All right, so this is how you mod your 3DS running version 11.17.0-50. It does not ma matter what region you're on, as long as you're on the latest version and you are on an old 3DS or old 2DS. Like this is the old uh, 3DS. So yes, now just power this off. Then just go into the link in the description, which is going to lead you to this page. You're going to download. And this is going to take, uh, yeah, some seconds. And boom, that's done. I'm gonna open this, open this, and here you're going to install Python if you don't already have the latest version. I'm just going to go through that and uh, yeah, through the installer and download that. Once that's done, you're going to go into root and then you're going to take out the SD card out of your 3DS. Plug it into your PC. There we go. And now you're going to drag all of these files from the root folder from your uh, from the file you downloaded onto the SD card. If it says that you need to override something, just override. This is going to take a second, just like that. Now you can take out the SD card out of your PC and plug it into your 3DS. Power on. Now go into Me Maker. There you go. You will probably get a uh, message to make some data. If not, then like I didn't. You can just go out of this, power off your 3DS, take out the SD card and plug it back into your PC. There we go. Now you need to open the mset9.bat uh, file or it might also just say mset9 for you. Open this, then press one and one again, and boom, it is missing some files, like it always does. Take out the SD card, plug it into your 3DS. If you did not get that message, then you can just skip this part. Um, I have done this like 10 times now, and uh, there has only been one time where it did not ask for those files. Um, so yeah. Now, go into system settings. Then go into data management, Nintendo 3DS, software, and reset. There we go. Now, you can just go out of everything, exit, and power off your 3DS. And once again, take out the SD card and put it into your PC. There we go, run the mset9, then one, one, and boom, everything appears to be functional. Press enter, now take out the SD card out of your PC, plug it once again into your 3DS, power it on. Now, go into system settings, Data management, Nintendo 3DS, and then extra data. Boom, now take out the SD card while it's still on. Do not go out of here or anything. Leave it on, just put it on your table. Now, put in the SD card into your PC. There we go, run mset9. Then press one, and then you're going to press two and enter. This is going to create the mod file on your SD card. And boom, that's done. I'm gonna press enter. Take out the SD card. Plug it into, into the 3DS. And boom. Now just follow what it says on the screen. A, and now your 3DS is officially, come on. Boom, modded. Gonna go out of here now. Gonna press start.
Boom. Now you can go into download play and then press down, select and L. Go into miscellaneous options. A, B, B, B. Now press home. X. And go into it again. And boom, now you can go into FBI, press A, then go down to CIAs, press A, and install and delete all CIAs. A, and boom, this is also going to download HSHOP, Homebrew, FBI, Anemone, what else? All other apps, Checkpoint, everything you'll need on your modded 3DS. Boom, I can just exit out of that. And boom, you're done. So now, if you're wondering how to install 3DS games on your modded 3DS, I'll throw that up here. This is how you play DS games on your modded 3DS. And this is how you install Game Boy games on your modded 3DS. Thank you guys for watching. Like, dislike, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.